<laughs> this is Messiah. And I've sung it many times. Okay. It rises, it raises us up, music, beauty. But we don't behave beautifully. We accept it. You hear it all the time. It's accepted. It's accepted that we have these wars in Iraq and Afghanistan will continue. It's accepted that our, our industry, the one thing we do manufacture and sell is arms in Britain. I've got my work cut out. Boy, have I got my work cut out. Here I am. I'm 54 years old. I'm not a child. Look at me in my little room. <laughs> Speaking to the world. But I know what's right and what's wrong. I know the difference between right and wrong. It's so obvious. I'm no politician. I'm not mincing my words. I'm far too honest. I would look people in the eye. I, I do look people in the eye and I say what I think. This is what I think. This is what I know in my soul. <sighs> Oh, Messiah is very beautiful. I used to sing in this choir in London. I had a little computing company and we were working for National Westminster Bank and, you know, they had a choir. And we ended up singing it. Just an amateur choir, but this was the pot boiler. This used to earn the, the ball beans. Always brought people in, so I've sung at the Barbican and Southwark Cathedral and the Royal Festival Hall and... Queen Elizabeth Hall, and I don't know, whatever. The big London halls. It's just so obvious! We, the West, have killed people in Iraq for oil, for our material well-being. It's not a closed chapter. This is in my lifetime. The First World War is not a closed chapter. The Second World War, sure, it's fading into the past. At least possibly had some moral justification for it. I wasn't there. Dietrich Bonhoeffer agonized with his soul, Shali or Shanti, the German priest. Try and kill Hitler for the greater good. No, he was wrong. I wasn't there. I am here now. I, I didn't have to face up to the consequences of my actions or lack of action or whatever. I would not have been a fighter at this age. But as a 17-year-old, I got my pilot's license through the Royal Air Force, for heaven's sake. Here in England at Oxford, Oxford Air Training School. That's what young people do. It's part of the culture. You don't question these things at that age, generally. But now I know, and I will speak. This is just a rehearsal. I know my Redeemer liveth in my soul, and I will speak. 